Hey everyone, this is Greg Johnson for VOScripts.com here to go through two methods of recording voiceover. The first method is the punch and roll method, which is a very common um, kind of standard form of recording voiceover at your computer. Um, you'll need control of your computer to do this, so you would need something like uh, another monitor, keyboard, and mouse set up in your booth, um, or if you were just recording right at your computer in a, an acoustically treated space, um, this would work for you. So I'm going to do a very quick run through of the punch and roll method. And so here I have a script pulled up. I'm just going to read the top here. Um, and uh, I'm going to mess up. Your business is your baby. You nurture it, watch it grow, and get. So I'm going to stop. I'm just going to go back to the and get. And get. Because that's where I messed up on the and give it everything you've got. Um, so I'm just going to punch in right here and roll. And give it everything you've got. But sometimes communication can be an issue. No matter what... Okay, so I, I messed up on no matter what. So, no matter what... But sometimes communication can be an issue. No matter what... So again, no matter what, no matter what you do, okay? No matter what you do or who you are, that's where Zencom comes in. I now have a complete voiceover that I do not have to go back and um, edit other than just timing or cutting out breaths and just tightening things up. So let's just listen from the top. Your business is your baby. You nurture it, watch it grow, and give it everything you've got. So there was a little timing issue there. We'll just uh, tighten that up. To grow and give it everything you've got. Okay, nice. Looks like there's a timing issue here too for the no matter. So let's see. Can be an issue. No matter what you do or who you are. Can be an issue. No matter what you do or who you are. So from the top, we have a full voiceover. Your business is your baby. You nurture it, watch it grow, and give it everything you've got. But sometimes communication can be an issue, no matter what you do or who you are. That's where Zencom comes in. So that's a pretty simple and straightforward way to do that. But again, you'll need control of your computer to do it where um, you may not have that. I have, in my case, a booth that I made out of a walk-in closet and I do not have control of my computer from in there. So when I'm recording in there, I use a dog clicker to um, signal that I messed up and I'm starting over again. Basically, I'm doing it anywhere that I would be punching and rolling if I were sitting at my computer. You can also use a hand clap, um, anything that has a loud transient sound. Um, so I'm going to demonstrate that for you. I'm not going to go into the booth, but I'm just going to do it from right here. Your business is your baby. You nurture it, watch it grow, and get and give it everything you've got. But sometimes communication can be an issue, no, ma no matter what you do or who you are. That's where Zencom comes in. Okay, so you'll see that we have some transients here from the dog click, so you can very easily see that that's where I messed up. Um, and this is personal preference, but I like to start from the back because usually um, the last take is going to be the one that I'm going with. Um, so like in this case, I'm assuming right here is where I messed up. No, ma no, ma no matter. No matter what you do. So I'm just going to make a cut here. And I'm going to go right where I said no, ma no matter. There's a breath there I could cut out if I want. And I'm just going to delete this with shuffle mode on. An issue, no matter what you do or who you are. Okay, great. And then, and give it everything you've got. And give. And get. And the and get. There's the and get again. And get. So I'm just make it, going to make a cut here. Going to find the and get. And get. Make a cut there. And delete. Watch it grow and give it everything you've got. Your business is your baby. You nurture it, 
watch it grow, and give it everything you've got. But sometimes, communication can be an issue, no matter what you do or who you are. That's where Zencom comes in. Great, so obviously if you use this method, which you may not have a choice, then you're going to be doing um, some editing after your recording is done. Um, it may be less and it may be more depending on how complicated the script is and how well you can get through it. Um, some more complex scripts you may not get through as easily and so you're gonna be doing a lot of clicking and a lot of editing. That's two methods for recording and editing voiceover, sometimes at the same time. I hope this was helpful, and uh, subscribe for more, and visit voscripts.com for practice scripts and demo reels and more voiceover goodies.